Hello everyone out in YouTube land. It's your girl, Lily, and I have been sitting here waiting for the DHL man to come and deliver me a little package that I'm going to open and share with you. Um, yeah, I wish I could say this is going to be it for a while for the whole unboxing. I, I want to do a ban island I want to do a no buy and all that kind of good stuff. It's just tough. It is just so tough. Especially when you think that you see a bargain, you know, oh, look at the condition. That's a bargain. That's a steal. Oh, it's old. They don't make them anymore. All, all that plays on me. And next thing you know, um, the weakness is real. The button pushing is also real. So I'm just saying. I'm going to say one more thing before I open this because some of y'all are like, Lee, open the bag, please. But so the last time, the last video was a Kalahari PM and I didn't tell my son or my daughter. Um, they are 35 and 39 respectively. And we are so, we're like a braid. We're so, so close. So, so cool. And we usually tell one another when we make purchases and stuff like that and share what we bought or whatever. But this is what we'll do. We'll say something like, we'll be on a FaceTime with one another and we'll be like, bad girl, bad girl. And they'll be like, what did you do? What did you buy? And the same with my son. He'll be like, bad boy, bad boy. And I'm like, oh what'd you do? You know what I mean? So I didn't tell them about the Kalahari and they're like, oh, you sneaked one in on us. Well, guess what? I didn't tell them about this one either. So they're both seeing it along with y'all and they're probably like, oh, okay, ma, I see how you playing. <laughs> but at any rate, they'll, they'll get on me because I keep talking about this whole retirement thing. I've got to get my ducks in a row. Ducks don't know what rows are, do they? Yeah, they do. Yeah, they follow behind their mom in a row, usually. Yeah, so they do know. I don't know. That was random, right? <laughs> Anywho, <laughs> I'm all giddy. Let's get into it. So I went ahead and took out the, the label, the shipping label. And I'm getting right into this, baby. You know what it is, guys. It is the, the Amazon. After the Amazon. The Louis Vuitton Amazon. And I think this is the, I want to say it's the, ooh, it looks like the GM because I don't know what it is. Here's a, I got it from these guys. But I'll, I'll just put it below so you can see the spelling and so forth because it has on here. Yeah, I'll do that. So it's in that plastic bag and then it's in bubble wrap taped and this has got to be the GM because this is big this is bigger than I thought it was gonna be see I'm such a trip because it's like oh man now this is like huge and I'm thinking is this what I want so it's in one of these little makeshift bags because it didn't come with a dust bag so this one is like mad old y'all um right out the gate you know how I do I'm smelling it <laughs> So, the whip test is, is, hold on. All right, it's good. It just feels hot, probably from being in their, their hot vehicle, the DHL vehicle. The canvas feels good. The strap feels pretty good, too. I was thinking that the strap was going to be, like, really, really stiff and tough but it's, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. So this is it. It's the Amazon. And I'm guessing this is the, the largest. Don't quote me. If you have questions, I will, um, I'll dig a little deeper and I will answer your questions. But I was simply scrolling. I think when I've got downtime, when I'm bored, sitting home in the evening and whatnot, I get on eBay. eBay is like a pastime. YouTube videos, pastime. So I think I plugged in Louis Vuitton vintage bags and this came up. 
And I was like, that's cute. And I liked it before. I actually purchased one before from a uh, Facebook group. And when I got it, it was so stiff. I mean, all of this canvas was like so friggin' stiff. I was like, that feels like hard and old and not taken care of very well. So I ended up sending it back and I spent like, I think 350 for it because I believed in the, the, how the Facebook groups are governed, at least the one that I belong to. I belong to a few of them though, probably three, but I just thought, you know, I trust them and I'm, I'm going to pay three and a quarter or something like that. But at any rate, guys, this was 230, 230 USD. And I thought that was a steal for a Louis Vuitton bag, especially an old bag. So this one is like, I think this is like 30 years old. I'm not going to look for the date code only because I don't want to um, dare take up your time. So let me just stop. But it smells okay. The zipper is nice. The zippers are nice color. But yeah, I do. I like it. I like it. A lot of times this Vachetta, um, Vachetta, 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 tomato, tomato, a lot of times this is gone. And, you know, I'm, I'm quite pleased to see that this one was included. Well, I knew it was, obviously. But I think the, the Vachetta looks really nice. A lot of times these little guys are all funky where they are torn and ready to come off. The, it's not bad. It's not really deep in color. Of course, there's some scuffing, but I, I like it a lot. I said that about the Kalahari. So this is it. And guys, I like it. As soon as I put it on and I can see it, um, yeah. It's, it's not bad at all. I like it. I'm 5'3", and I'm going to try to see what hole it is on. It is on the longest setting, but I do like my bags to, my crossbody bags, I like them to hit me low. My TV just went off. That was weird. Um, like the electricity went off or something. We did just have a storm. My DHL guy um, got out in the pouring rain, and our electric did just go off because my home alarm thingy is yeah sorry for that a little interruption there but yeah so this is it <clears throat> this is the louis vuitton amazon they refer to it as a camera bag like it would have been um created for like your camera and accessories like maybe the accessories would go here the zipper is pretty fluid now, it did say that this pocket was junk. And it is like peely inside there and slightly sticky. Nothing like a little cleaning wouldn't do. And thank goodness for all of you that make cleaning videos and sticky pocket videos and all that kind of stuff because it looks like somebody attempted this. So I think with a little more cleaning on my part to get the, the residual out, um, it'll be usable. But even knowing that that back pocket was what they call junk, I'm not seeing it as junk. But And it said unusable. I'm not seeing that either. But they are, the Japanese are brutally honest in my experience. Their laws are stringent. It's a whole different ball game over there. But uh, yeah, I can work with this. I, when reading that it was junk, I thought, well, I just won't use that back pocket. If I got this front pocket here, which is the cross grain leather in that front pocket and in the main compartment, that's all I need. Okay, now the electric just came back on and I hear neighbors outside. The neighbors converge and, hey, are you sure, are you sure? Do you have lights? So, anywho. But guys, thank you for riding with me. Like I said, if you have questions, um, Please ask me. I don't know. I didn't bring a tape in or whatever, but, oh man, maybe three, maybe six inches by like eight inches, maybe six inches this way, like half a foot, and then maybe eight inches this way. I did see 
I think those those numbers um, when I was like watching videos and stuff. But if you really wanted to know something, please don't hesitate to hit me below and and ask me. But I'm looking at the sides and they're decent. The the zipper pulls are nice and golden. And I know this bag is like a 30 year old bag. So I really like it. I do like it in person. And you know, when you get pre-loved, you're always like, oh man, I hope it's everything in person. And this definitely is. I think the, the condition is good. Like I said, this strap is way more pliable than I thought it would be. I thought, oh man, that's going to be stiff and whatnot. But nope. I likes it. So, anywho, that's it. And hopefully, that's it for a minute because I'm going to have to do some other videos, like my little planner videos or whatever. I know somebody requested a planner video, and I do have um, a few planners going on. My Moleskine, um, a little Moleskine, my pocket Moleskine, that is like one of my faves. So, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> but I, uh, I gotta, I gotta stop this. If I am going to retire, I'm going to have to stop all this. Oh, that's a good price. And the condition is great. And oh my gosh, it's so old, but it still looks good for its age. I gotta get it. I'm glad I did this time. And I was glad I got the cow heart and I was glad I got. So anywho, guys, um, yeah, just wanted to share it with you. One more little go at it. But I, yeah, I do like it. Yep, yep, yep. It's a cutie patootie. So yeah, that's it. But hey, thank you so much for tuning in to see an unboxing again. But uh, yeah, thank you to all of my new subscribers, all that you, you know, all you guys that are, are joining the little family. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. It's, it's just fun for me. I'm not looking for this or that out of it. I'm not looking for, you know, a hundred thousand, you know, da, 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 da. I'm just having fun connecting with people and just, you know, we're watching one another's video. Y'all give me feedback, compliments, comments, questions, whatever. I love it all. And it's just, it's just fun for me. So um, consider subscribing if you would. Give it a like. Yep. Yeah, give it a little thumbs up and be, be blessed. Be blessed guys. And I will see you soon in the next video. And it will not be an unboxing. It might be a what's in my bag or something like that. But yeah, I'm going to try to stay away from this for a minute. Get my ducks in a row. So thanks again, guys. Thank you so much. And have a great day, evening, night, whatever you got going on. And I'll see you in my next video. And you know I got to run because that's my time. Bye, guys.